What is going on guys? Welcome back to the Assassin's Creed Black Flag Let's Play on my channel. Now let's get into the if you didn't see, first of all, if you didn't see the last episode, it'll be linked in the description below. You can go check that out. So yeah, let's get let's get into this video this let's, this episode, sorry. And we have to find a way to Havana. In Cuba. We're going to Cuba guys. So should I go on this that school will do me just fine. So I do gotta go this way, alright. Um so I gotta stay stealth, but how do I do that? Cause I gotta get up on here. Stalking zone. I thought I'd die for a minute. I got scared as hell, y'all. Dense vegetation can be used as stalking zones. They allow you to hide and move undetected. Use them to approach targets stealthily. Okay, so I can use these. Oh god! Oh god! Oh, he coming this way. Both of them are. Oh shit! Oh lord! Take my sugar. Take anything you like. Come on, one of them gotta turn around, bruh. Or I could just go this way. Oh, no. Fucking oh, big ass you. turtle anything right there, you know. Like. You better get to that boat. Run. Oh. No. 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 Oh my god, bruh. Alright, so I know I have to. That school will do me just fine. The Commodore's gonna head to Kingston, where to commandeer this lover's ship and fall out. Sorry. Okay, we already know about the stalking zones. That was in the last thing. These motherfuckers looking at me, man. Hold it! <laughs> Stop them! Give me one reason I shouldn't vent your skull. Take my sugar! Take anything you like! <laughs> Bro, he like right anything there.
Oh my god, yo, he's like right next to me. Oh, I know he saw me. I know he saw me, bruh. Take my sugar. Take anything you like. How the hell am I supposed to do that? I'll pay you anything you like. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, boy. Let's go. Let's go. Beast mode. By God's grace, sir, you saved me. A profusion of thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its poor captain, and I have no art for sailing. I can pilot her myself, no mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name, friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the King, God save us, and I must get to Havana with speed. Ah, oh, that is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Ah, oh, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. Gave me quite a fright. All things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? <laughs> Lacking a rowboat, I'm a to swim to my ship. Hard Hold on, I want to see something, because I need a damn picture of this. This John, that, I need a picture of that water. That water looks beautiful. No, I guess not. I mean, no, did this? Oh, man, yeah, hold on. All right, there we go. Oh, oh this, this is difficult. I should have taken the coat off. So you telling me these motherfuckers was over here the whole time and didn't help that nigga on the ground. Okay. Alright. Welcome aboard, Duncan. She's a modest schooner, but well I purpose trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to full, shall we? This is pretty ah, cool. There's a tug of the wind at my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. The raw stink of of possibility. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. We've really opened it up now, haven't we? <laughs> Those sailors were quite animated by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling strait. But I shouldn't worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses. Rather, that sort of thing. 
There's not a pirate living who turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. This, yeah, I love I love the graphics on this game. Like you like the it should look so nice. Especially the water. Damn it. This thing. Oh, there we go. I was about to say. I'm holding A the whole time. This shit going slow. Dose the gallants and royal. Ground it all on. Oh, that big ass whale. This is a big ass map. You're a natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. promising oh since since I haven't played Assassin's Creed since the first one I can't I didn't remember this was all a simulation well your numbers look good now let's make sure we can break your brain, all right? I need you to move your head and look at these lights just here. Look up. That's it. Down. So far, so good. Let's get you up. So, welcome to the Sample 17 project. Before you get started, you're gonna need this. Testing, testing, one, two, three, hello, bonjour, c'est bon, it works. <laughs> All right, let's take a walk. Your file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, which is surprising. You're very good. The data streams are very stable. Impressive, right? This building is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, since 2010. What you looking at, bro? What you looking at? What you looking at? Maybe you saw Liberation? That was our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just the tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course edited versions of real history but only the exciting parts and we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature caribbean pirates so that's your gig <laughs> it'll just take a minute okay well thank you nancy bon journée. what, what, what bon. the hell am i Magnifique. Merci. This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around.
employee passport. Your passport to success at Abstigo Entertainment. Okay, whatever, fuck that. Oh, this is nice. See that flashing wireless signal? It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you do the honors. We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio, second floor. Oh, that's hot. You ready? Let's go. Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Have you met our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey, then, Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, ar, yar, maybe. <laughs> Very exciting. Welcome aboard. Uh, Melanie, can we talk in your office for a minute? Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in five minutes. C'est bon. Nice to meet you. So, this is the sample 17 floor. We're diving into the memories of one very generous donor, Desmond Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from the And hopefully one day, we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right. So here we are, your very own Animus workstation. This is all yours, so sit back, relax, and find us some good footage. If you need any hints or tips, the Animus is loaded with tutorial programs, so you'll have no problems. And I'll check in on you later. Happy pirating. Welcome to Animus Omega, Abstergo Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie Lynn. Yeah, I got a fucking question. When we going to get this in real life? Of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neurotransmitters activated. Alright guys, please drop a like on the video for me. Let's see if we can get the video up to 10 likes. Subscribe if you haven't and thanks for watching. Please tune in next time for the next episode of Assassin's Creed Black Flag Let's Play. Lively Havana. I've been here once before. It was a truly awful pleasure. See someone you know. No, no, no. Just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. Right. Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious. Yeah. Mad to think Spain and England were at war two years ago, isn't it? Here I am, bartering with Spaniards like they were my cousins. Wrong, Duncan. No, it's nothing. Sand in my hampers. So, where's the best squad in town? I'm dying for a quick kip or a siesta, should I say? Um, I'm just headed to uh, a public house now to meet some merchants. I could, I could show you the way. Well, lead on. I hope.
Alright guys, please check, tune in next time for another Assassin's Creed Let's Play. Please drop a like on this video, subscribe if you haven't, and let's see if we can get the video up to 10 likes guys, and thanks for watching.